Hi everybody, this is Be Divine. Thank you so much for following here. I hope that you will enjoy the messages. This is a longer message. Now I'm going to try to see what this is going to be about. The soul, the moon, love, and genius energy. Okay, something changing quickly. So as you all know, I am a dimensional channel. I'm an author. I teach you guys how to change your vibration and therefore generate the life that you are actually looking for. And what we have to do is understand who we are as a soul, okay? What we are focused on, where our abilities lie, and what things are coming that are unique to us. The Uranus energy here. If you were looking at your birth chart, let's just say that you had the energy of Uranus in your fourth house. That might have meant that as a child, all you did was move around or lots of shocking events happened. Wherever Uranus is, it is a shock. It's something that just comes up and here it is. And it always sends us into forward motion because we have no choice but to act, right? As a soul, you are moving in a direction that brings you peace. This is what everybody wants. Watching the news, watching the politics, watching debates, watching people argue, getting involved in people's arguments online and all that. Where does that lead you in your soul journey? It just keeps you going around in circles and becoming frustrated. So the idea is, is that we understand what it is as a soul, what it is to be a soul. So let me explain that. Okay, here we go. Uh, you are a soul, okay? You don't have a soul, you are a soul, okay? As a soul, let's just say, we're just gonna use a circle. There you are as a soul, okay? So you've had all these different lifetimes, okay? All these different connections with people, places, and things. Then you've had all of these different chords, Okay, soul chords, okay, relationship chords, all right, genetic chords, past life, and then you have uh, relational okay just to name a few different chords so you have all these different lifetimes okay then you have all these different ancestors okay you have life uh, traumas okay and then you have Blessings, of course, things that happen to us that we love, okay? We have uh, galactic um, chords, okay, connections. And with relationship, that talks about every single person you know now bear with me I'm trying to write this quickly as I can okay so just have a look here you are as a soul just with these few things okay look at all this stuff coming out from you just with these few things soul chords relationship chords every single person you know slept with right connected with good or bad, okay? These chords are still attached to you. Every single person that you've ever had a relationship with are still attached to you. Everything that is genetic, you know, through your family roots and your ancestry is connected with you. Your life traumas, the blessings, the births, the house moves, going to hospital, having operations, 
right? Living near cemeteries, moving into somebody's house, moving into a flat or an apartment. Have you ever done a clearing, a proper clearing on all these different aspects to understand why you may have things that have happened with you, okay? This is the idea of yourself as a soul, is to understand the interconnectedness, okay, of every single aspect of yourself. Then you have the chakras, okay, the auric field, which is very, very important. You have the lesser chakras as well, okay. There's lots of different um, aspects of you, okay. These are, these are coming out from you and they amplify the energy within. If as a soul you have all of these things that is blocking your pathway because you've never gone through and sifted through all of this or had someone do it with you, this is where I come in. I go with you through all of these different aspects of yourself with the timeline and then we're able to dissolve and clear all of these things that are blocking you from going forward. If you don't understand yourself on the deepest of levels, okay, and not to mention the things that have happened to you as a child or the psychic attack that has occurred or all of the things like with our nightmares and sleep paralysis, uh, people putting hexes and spells, all of those things also can affect the soul individually, okay, uh, in your physical being and your emotional being, in your mental health. You can close down the chakras and your auric field um, or it can be closed down like a force field upon you someone else can do this to you. You can have energy bands. You can have different types of energy plays. You can have fake angels and, you know, dark masters that are working with you. You can have astral interferences. You can have all kinds of manipulations. However, what you are learning here through following this channel and through listening to my teachings that you're learning that you can overcome any of it and all of it and master your life. Because we are here to be spiritual masters, okay? We are not here to struggle and to stress. We're not here to um, lose, okay? We're not here to be weak. Okay, if you understood who you are completely as a soul, where you've been, what you've done, you would never doubt yourself again. If you knew what sort of spiritual light team you have on your side, hoping that you will be able to break free and understand all of this energy, to become the healer that you always wanted to be, the psychic, the spiritual person, the teacher, the guide, you know, to do it in a different way right? To really, really help people. You know, and this is what I don't get. People who are really trying to help people, such as myself, we get pushed to the bottom of the pile because everyone's all about some kind of fortune telling. And no more. The underdogs are winning here. We're moving up. And if you want something more thorough in your life, this is what I'm teaching you all. Soon, I'm not going to be the practitioner anymore. It's been so many years. I'm teaching you everything I know and how to figure this all out and how to chart these things. You are supposed to be a spiritual master in your life, whether it's a professional thing or just the way that you live. The struggle, the stress, the loss, the this, the that, all the negativity cannot win or cannot prosper over you unless you let it. Okay, understand there's a way out of absolutely everything. Okay. And it's time that people get out of their own damn way. That's what it is. You're in your way. Okay, free yourself. We are here to live free. Does not matter what restrictions you have around you that are not your fault. Okay, your brain, your mind can free you. Free your mind, as they say, and the rest will follow. Sending you... So much love and support, you know where to find me.